Hi guys, I just had to pop back on. This is part two of Kingdom and Culture. And I just wanted to add on that there are certain things that a um, kingdom person will receive versus a culture person um, from the Lord. So there are certain things that if you are kingdom minded, um, that doors will open for you and things will begin to manifest in your life. So that's why he said that um, to call, come boldly to the throne to him and also um, to seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness and he would add all of these things unto us. But we have to go to the king and through the king in order to be kingdom and to receive the promises. But if we are not kingdom and we are not kingdom mindset, we don't have a kingdom mindset, then it will be no way for us to receive the promise. So basically what I'm saying is, is, is that... <laughs> If you have a kingdom mentality, that it's going to open the door for manifestation. And if you have a culture mentality, like the mentality of the world, then you're going to have a um, tough time here in this life. Because, uh, yeah, we, we, we got to fix this. And as I look around today, I see a lot of people who are culture, again, and not kingdom and they're wondering why their lives are the way they are so um i just wanted to pop on and say that if you are kingdom then um you're going to be looking at a lot of manifestation and if you are culture then um you know more power to you and you know if you especially if you culture and you want to stay culture so um yeah, that's all I have for today, guys. Kingdom and culture. And um, I just wanted to kind of add to that, that you'll get manifestation if you are kingdom. All right. Thank you guys for tuning in to my channel, Vlog Talk. And it's always a pleasure to vlog and talk.